had never won a guessing game in his life. No matter how he came out, it always ended in a loss. Even when playing with a group of people, everyone comes up with rock. Then he must be the one to make the scissors. Roy and the lady in the supermarket are fighting over the same bento and they are at each other's throats. Then it's a guessing game to decide the winner. It seemed to be his life's destiny to lose. On his way home from work he sees a sign. Guessing course. Wasn't this for him? An old voice came out. Roy has lost again. The old man was the teacher of the course. They try a few more times. Roy tried to use reverse thinking, but no matter what, he couldn't win. And the old man looked so calm and collected. Even the old man couldn't win. Roy was furious. The old man's body flashes, appearing directly behind Roy. He is the one who has the spirit of a fairy. Now Roy was so impressed, he immediately signed up. He just wanted to win a guessing game, even if it was just once. The old man led him into the dojo. The old man asks what guessing is. The old man told him, the true meaning of guessing is life. The winner can also lose. The cycle goes on and on. All uncertainty is in his own hands. Roy began the discipline of guessing, sharpening his patience by scrubbing the floor, growing strength by chopping wood every day. Cooking over a fire increases dexterity, washing clothes to cleanse the mind. Suddenly Roy felt something was wrong. Isn't he just babysitting for the old man? What kind of practice is that? He doesn't want to do it anymore. He thinks the old man is just screwing him over. Roy left.